Hello, today we are going to use neural networks for image processing. Yes, it's quite an interesting thing because it's unusual. <laughs> uh, let's start our program and see how we can use it. Of course, we use this program for animation, but today we are going to make some experiment, like setting to iteration to 1 and input source image and result image, how it should look like. Of course, I did it in the built-in Windows program, this post effect, uh, but also you can use some tutorials from the internet, like making photos look like analog or something like this, to make your own uh, filters. In fact, when you create a neural network, you made some kind of filter or kernel in terms of convolution for usual image processing. But it is much simpler how it works. You can you just took one picture, uh, get all these pixels and get all pixels of second picture and s send it to network to train. As a result, you've got to train a network that can make from this picture this picture. Everything is simple. So let's decrease the amount of neurons because it's quite simple, kernel is for me, and train. some processing. You can use uh, quite small pictures because for training it's not necessary to use big data and big data can take a lot of time for learning. But execution is quite fast so you can use big photos or something like this if you want to make effects for Instagram or something like this. We have quite small error, less than 1% so it's working pictures and we can use on something other. Let's... You see it's empty folder and let's apply this neural network on this target picture. As you can see, we applied filter without line of code. And of course you can create any kind of filter without any line of code, just this common algorithm of building filters. Let's try on something else, I think. It's much more interesting to try something else. We can use also something like warm filter, for example, we use this one picture. But be aware, pictures should be the same size. Or we've got an exception here. Let's train. In fact, I'm using not very fast library for neural networks and uh, set get pixel algorithm. If you will uh, use direct access to the memory, it will run much more, much faster. Also small error, let's try to run and apply for this picture and see the result. Of course you cannot use such software for creating effects like vignetting or something like this, because it's not taking a whole picture, it just to uh, neighbors pixel by pixels. As you can see, a uh, result image looks much warmer and again without the line of cut. So we can try another picture. If you want to use something not BMP format, you just set this filter mode. Oh, this. I think this feature can be implemented into some uh, picture editors.
for users can do their own filters basically uh, on some input and result images. Still working. took much more time because I'm using the recording software that's record screen too so keep this in mind Do you see it is much warmer again without any line of code this came into this thanks for watching bye